Are we all right? There we go. One year in the making. There we go. This is Pat Willard, the artist who made this fantastic work. Thank you guys. Pat will say a few words. Well, about 15, 20 years ago, I worked in the Young Offenders Institution. And I walked in one morning to do an art lesson. And mornings aren't a good time for me. And I did um, a, a demonstration of a uh, country scene for the boys. And uh, at the end of it, one of them who'd got a shaven head and a swallow on his forehead, folded his arms and said, well, look, I think that's bloody rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> it's a wonder I ever put brush to silk again after that. Um, but um, a year ago, Paul, suggested that we did, or I did, a mural of Leeds for the art unit in, in, in this market. And uh, I was very reluctant, because as you can see, I'm a florally person, abstract person. But um, he took me around Leeds, and he told me to look up, as you mentioned, and there were these beautiful domes and spires, and they were just too good not to use. And so Paul took the photographs, which are here, so that hopefully you can identify some of the buildings on here. And um, actually, we, we made line drawings out of the photographs, then uh, Pat could work from those line drawings to make. We were talking about, I presume you're going to be talking about whether we should, you should colour the work or not, but I'll leave that to you. To talk. Well, there wasn't, no. <laughs> <laughs> but it looked stunning as it was without the colour, but even better now, well, I think. Yeah, you know all about telling me to where to put the colour for. Now I've lost my train of thought. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, and so Paul took the photographs, I did tracing something, and it was then a case of putting them underneath the silk because you can't do your initial pencil drawings on them and deciding what was going where. And we used a lot of artistic license by not putting places in the right. It, it's artistic license, that's called. You just make a lovely design of them. And this is what we both did together. Um, and there was a lot of collaboration on the colour and the design and everything. And um, yeah, it's taken a year to paint. It's, um, a craft or art, I'm not sure what it's called, that originated in Russia and it was in fact taught to the French by the Tsar's family and that's where I saw it done, not in Russia, in France. And we used to have lots of silk painters in this country but unfortunately they just seemed to have disappeared. So, Pat has uh, workshops, so if you'd like to learn the, the <laughs> art and craft, and she'll do that for you. I've got visual aids here, so <laughs> I'm not to, to bring out. <laughs>